This show, To the Ocean, is a modern retelling of the Selkie myth, where people transform between human beings and seals. It's told with a cast of four with a few props. Built from reused materials to the small construction, it's built at the first zero waste theatre in the UK. Hidden amongst the skyscrapers in London's financial district, the small potable venue is staging plays in the capital over the summer. The idea is to bring people together and raise awareness of environmental protection in a gentle way. It's about not necessarily ramming climate change or sustainable choices down your throat. It's about just inviting you to see a different way of, yeah. like, how do we actually interact with the world? And also, how does, as we move away from, like, as we move away from rural settings, how does our relationship with magic change? Because it's obviously yeah. it's a fairy tale, so there is a bit of magic in there. Yeah. And that's why actually it's so lovely being here, because we're in Canary Wharf right now, you know, in the middle of, like, skyscraper city yeah, so industrial and we've just got this lovely like venue popped up in this green space of london so it just feels really special to be in like an oasis this. Definitely. yeah yeah definitely the theater space can host up to 50 audience members some are impressed with the ethos of the theater i'm very concerned i think like many people about climate change and i think it's really interesting to see how personal or individual um, actions can take place just as theatre because like um, theatre production or media production in general can be so wasteful especially if you think about like the film industry and just huge theatre productions so it's lovely to see that it is possible to do without such waste uh, it definitely feels like the beginning of it however with trips to the theatre considered a luxury during Britain's cost of living crisis the founder is worried for future projects Mostly at the moment, our fund, we're, we're funding ourselves through ticket sales and through bar sales. Um, unfortunately, with the cost of living crisis, it's not doing quite as well as, as we'd like it to, um, which, is a, which is a real shame. It's, it's kind of putting some of the, our future projects in a bit of jeopardy. Um, but we hope that we'll be able to just kind of keep plowing on through and people will start to hear more about us and more people will come to our shows, more people will buy drinks. Um, we, have, we do some private funding as well, like through donations on our website and that kind of thing. Um, but mainly, the vast majority is through ticket sales and bar. And we'd love that to be doing better. The theatre director said his target audiences are aged between 16 and 35, who tend to be very worried about the environment. The upcycled theatre here serves to form a community where they can make a difference, no matter how small that is. Li Jianhua, CGTN, London.